Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of the Battle for Astrakhazy. Last episode, the Dragon's Rejects were able to push forward and liberate a small area which appeared to be, you know, not wanting to be part of the Magashi province anymore. So what we're going to do is we're going to move the Night Gaunts, now that they've been refit and ready for service, they're going to move in to the south here and hopefully smash the rest of the uh, Magashi forces that are on the, on the uh, border of Karima. All right, here we are. So we're going to move up. Now we do have um, a fair amount of guys on us. We've got a Lance of six max. Orders. And we do have uh, three vehicles. So we do have uh, Svantovit now. Uh, pair of Mortar twos, Shriek SRM4s. It's a clan It's a clan vehicle, so I couldn't not employ it in battle. So I got tr like, to try and get rid of the other two vehicles. Once we get clan vehicles, we're going to get rid of them. Uh, I prefer not to run this, but I think we're going to just try and go all clan with this particular playthrough. So what I've done is I had to go and hire another pilot. So we've hired Polcat here, who's actually not very good. Gunnery 2, piloting 4, uh, Guts 2, and Tactics 6. Uh, their skills have only been increased, I believe, because of the units? Because I don't... I thought our Tactics were 4 and our piloting was 3. Anyway, regardless, um, so she's taken over the Griffin, and I've put the Nova in the hands of Gatekeeper. Now, the Nova's layout is a pair of uh, Clan SRM20s, uh, or sorry, LRM20s, um, a pair of Clan LRM5s, ER micro laser, and a pair of regular medium lasers for backup. But it's going to be our missile mech for the next little bit. Now, this wasn't how I wanted to lay this thing out. But I don't have proper heat sinking. That's the problem. I don't have a lot of heat sinks and other other gear, other clan gear. So we got to be on the lookout for double heat sinks, um, double heat sink kits, things like that, because we're really running low on on heating. We got to look for exchangers, anything we can get that's going to lower our heat. I couldn't really load this guy out like the way I wanted. But an LRM fifty is not that bad. We've got Sam ammo, standard ammo, mine clearing ammo. So I mean. And I think we've got enough to last. Like that's that's ten turns of firing right there, plus mine clearing and stuff. So, you know, we do have a little bit of ammo for this thing. Not a lot. I, I if I was going to run this, I would have a I'd run it run it with an Artemis system. But once again, we don't have any uh, a sufficient amount of Artemis ammo. Now we do have the enemy out here in the open. That's interesting. A hunter. I don't know what that is. Ultralight carrier. So we're just going to move up and try and punish these guys fast and hard. Let's move. I'm going to run the Kit Fox and the Nova together as our uh, long-range uh, art artillery lance. So that's pretty low chances to hit, uh, but we're going to take it anyway. Target no They've got two lances, so I don't see this going that long. It's nine against eight on, in our favor. And this is a two and a half skull mission, just so you know, so I don't expect it being that bad. Now we do still have a lot of light mechs and stuff. But, you know, Target acquired. it's not really that bad. We're, we'll, we'll do okay with this. And we're not fighting clanners either, so. Negative damage. All right. Yes, Commander. Let's get up as fast as we can. Gonna be out of range. Let's just get up in the trees. All right. Nice big fat LRM 50, but I'm going to hold off firing on the first turn. We've only got 10 turns. I mean, we should be more than enough, like, more than fine, but I'm going to hold off because we definitely have a better, uh, Going to full throttle. we'll have better chances to hit after these guys move. All right. What else do we got back here? What's this guy? Whitworth? And this guy, I don't know. I don't know. Just pop, pot shot this guy, I think. We got incendiary and what? Standard? Let's just go standard. Firing on target. Ooh, nice. Nice hit. Glad I put you in the griffin. You got gunnery too and you were able to hit. I got a locust back here. Shooting on the hunter, eh? Alright. 
You do you, Chief. What's this guy? Chiquita? I hear ya. That cougar up here. Got it. Max speed, no shooting. So as we start getting more clan weapons and stuff, um, we'll definitely be able to fudge around with the uh, loadouts. Not gonna bother. It's a problem of being fast. Is you go first, and they're, they've got spawn protection. So... Oh! Wow! I put you there myself, and uh, apparently you're stuck. Okay. Well, not much I can do about that. Just brace this turn. Yeah. Like you're using a lot of heat. So this is the Svanth of it. Man, this thing's got some speed to it. Understood. Moving fast. The armor's not that great. The weaponry, weaponry's, you know, okay. It's got a bit of speed to it. I don't like that. Centurion. That's the Chikeda. I have no idea what that is. Two point six. I don't know. Let's just drop the mortars on this guy, I guess. Got a fair bit of ammo, so might as well splash it up. He's finally moving. Yeah. So as I was saying about initiative. You know, when you're faster on turn one, you can move and get the shots off, but you can't hit your enemy. And if you decide to reserve and let them move first, you, you'll shoot, but then chances are you won't be fast enough to be moving faster than them next turn. So they'll go and then you'll go and then they'll go again, as opposed to like you getting a couple couple of shots off them in a row. So. She's stuck in the mud. It's all right, though. That's all right. Oh, trebuchet. I'm receiving you. Full speed. Quick step in it. Out of range still. All right, both sides are getting our fire lines up. Screw you. Light damage. Holding firm. Who is that? That's this guy. No. Ultra light carrier. So that's a mortar carrier. That's a nice play. Receiving you. Shooting like that and then pulling back into the trees. It's a good play. But going full throttle. We ain't letting you shoot again. We're not gonna let you shoot again, so let's go after this guy. Fire, get it. Oh he's got a Mars. There he goes. Enemy vehicle destroyed. I'm here. Alright, giant. Let's just show these guys what we're made of. Let's get in here. Full throttle. Let's give it to him. Let's want this Whitworth gone. Leave the boltons for now. Feel my wrath. Succeeded in missing the target. Yeah, Didn't thanks. Fire. I saw that. I saw that. Huh. All right. Let's well. Move. If we're gonna shoot, we gotta get close. Let's do it. Let's get this guy. Target acquired. One v two. Looks like he's got LRM fives. A rocket packs probably. Minimum damage. This guy is nothing. Aye, aye. Hi, pull cat. Let's get up here. I feel weird about giving somebody else the griffin, but our guys have already got the experience in these mechs, so I don't want to throw that away, you know? Alright, it's fire on this guy. Oh! Pilot took the head right off. That's a kill. I'm liking pull cat already. She was born to be in that griffin. Let's just hope she doesn't die. Uh, cicada with a bunch of Bell RMs. That's kind of nice. 
Waiting on you, Commander. All right, buddy. Wish you were a little faster. Going turbo. Wish you was a little faster, but that's all right. Got some good solid armament. Twenty-three. Same as this guy. Same on this guy. So we'll just take one shot for now. Yeah, he had rockets. That's a miss. That's a big miss. Just trying to speed this combat up ever so slightly. So we can hopefully get a second match in today. Still out of range, eh? Alright. Double time. Let's go. Still out of range. It's kinda of why I like the, having the LRMs on the vehicles, because then at least they can shoot from a good distance. Yeah, one hit. We'll take it. Let's full up sprint this. Get over to here. I think I want to go after that cicada though. What's the chance? Uh, 18. 40 on the, I guess we go after the hunter. Let's go after the hunter then. Our clustering's not the best, but we'll see how it goes. Alright, some pretty good damage. Looks like we penned. You got a mortar on you? Is that what it was? Hunter on hunter battle, eh? System holding. Hunchback. That's that guy's a hunchback, really? Didn't look like a hunchback. Commander. But he's trying to get close, so he must have something sneaky up his sleeve. Roger. Got a bit of a flanking maneuver over here. We're gonna stay on this hunter, see if we can get rid of it. I copy. Alright. Waiting for orders. Roger. I got a feeling that hunchback. 4 SP. So he's got the short range missiles and the lasers, so I don't feel that bad about it. Let's see if we can get the kill on, well, you got substantial damage, so let's just target this guy. Yeah, there we go, nice. Nice. Target's taking a critical hit. The laser shot might have been a bit overkill on the uh, vehicle. See if we're in Pulse laser range here. Are we? Not quite. Let's throw these up though. Locking on. Maybe we get a kill here. Nope. I'm out of SRM. Ready to get it on. Know where I can get a shot in that vehicle without being seen by everybody, huh? Yeah, I guess not. I don't want to push too much, though. Let's just get into here. Let's not push too, too much. Um, yeah, maybe we can kill this guy. Sure. Spread that damage around as much as you possibly can. For the benefit of dragging this match out as long as we possibly can. So the trebuchet is the 8 something. Is that the MRM version? You. That's the 8K, right? Is that what the trebuchet was? Yeah, so we faced that in the last one, right? Yeah. Yeah, we faced that in the last mission. Okay. Alright. Let's get into here. Let's hammer this guy.
Yeah, my clustering's terrible. Might have been better to give it to somebody with what better clustering, but like I said, I don't want to lose the uh, uh, the buildup we've got with the other mech pilots and their affinities. Pedal to the metal. That's an 80, we'll take that. And we'll use the, one of the shots from the rocket pack as well. Uh -huh. Nice, one hit. Nice. Commander. Let's get that PPC on that uh, hunchback, see if we can bring it down. We had a lousy chance to hit though. Well, I mean, she's not the best, uh, best pilot. So, I mean, it's better than anybody else. Well, except for this. Well, no, it is better than that. We'll go. Oh, three for three now. With that PPC. Guys tagged. Who do we have left? We got vehicles. We got the Svantivit left on 10. Cloudbuster. And the Hunter still. So maybe we use the vehicles on the hunt their Hunter. He's backing up. Yeah, you stand on the corpse of that guy. Oh, that really hurts. Wow, what is he using? Uh, he's probably got MMLs. Order. Fifty-one on this guy, eh? Let's see what we can get on him. Wow, that was a CT hit. You know, there's those times when clustering is great when you want to burrow through somebody, but then when you want to be able to splash it all over the place and hopefully get a different, uh, like, the two different torsos were exposed. If we were able to splash it, we could hit both torsos, but because their clustering is so good, they all hit the same spot. Yeah, this guy gets away from falling over. System's holding. It's okay, they're falling into our trap, so we're good. What trap? You'll see. You'll see. Oh, where are you going? He spotted the trap. He heard me say, you fall into here. my trap, and he just, he's like, oh shit, gotta get out of here. Trap? Did somebody say Drop trap? Kicking it. Did somebody say trap? Crap. No, I said crap is what I said. That's a miss. Sure is. All right, well, he's in AC-10 range. Time to back the fuck up. Reporting. Heavy damage. Yeah, I saw that. that shot got past my armor. Move order received. I saw that. Okay, let's keep fire up on this guy. Nice. I think I hit something good. What's up, boss? Okay, let's get over here. On the move. Let's target this guy. Is that a range for Hydra, huh? Engaging target. Okay. Who's going next? Oh, they're, they're uh, Locust. Uh, he's pretty quick. How fast are these guys? 14, 11, 12? Yeah, we're alright. Most of us, most of our guys go before they do, so. Yeah, you better run. It's not going to save you. Yes, Commander. Let's get up over here. Took a hard hit, so we're just going to drop behind this rock for now. Yes, Commander. It's not bad. Confirmed. Not a bad position over here. 
46 on the vehicle. Twenty-seven. Let's go with the best chance to hit. Maybe you could take that hunter out. Although I don't know, this thing's been surviving since like forever. Let's use Incinder to do a little bit more damage. Enemy outflank, bringing the pain. Wow, four for four. Vehicle fragged. I hear you. You're hired, kid. You are hired. I read you, Commander. Moving out. Permanently hard, that is. We're not going to get rid of her. All right, we're going to drop everything on this guy. You betcha. Ah, uh, he's still going, eh? Let's get our stability back, move over here. Attack this guy. Yeah, LRM-50 is like, okay. We're not putting out any big numbers with it, though. Ready for orders. Let's get around here. Commander. All right, Marlin. Straight up on this guy. Okay. And joy. There he goes. SRM ammo explosion. He exploded real good. May the good Lord take a liking to you and blow you up real soon. Uh huh. Light damage, Commander. I'm interested to know what this cicada's got. Two missiles, maybe two LRM 10s? Oh, he may have long fires. Hmm, that's a possibility. Like, or the Zeus's or whatever they are. 21. 26. Let's go after the the uh, Centurion here. Roger that. Target confirmed. Yeah. Yeah. No love on that strike. Receiving you. On my way. Get into here. Eight. Terrible. Terrible chances to hit. Well, we're going to fire the Centurion then. Engaging. At least it spreads some damage around. Oh, the streaks didn't connect, eh? Oh, well. At least we didn't waste any ammo. Save a few sea bills there, eh? Yeah, we're in MRM range now, I think. Oh no, that's just the LRM-15. Nothing to see here. It's the LRM-15, I think. Ooh. Shit, we gotta back up. I'm losing weapon systems. See that. I'm receiving you. Alright, let's get up here. All right, fire it all on this guy. Firing. Okay, handful of hits. Handful of hits. He goes next, though. Let's see what he does. We got the mongoose to follow that up, though. His best, his best bet would be to move back. Yeah. Forces my light mechs to expose to attack him. They ain't exposing yet. Standing by. They ain't exposing yet. Acknowledged. We're gonna get up this way first. I want that hill. Commander. I think Heading we go out. after this Centurion. Sixty percent. 66, 47, lousy. Uh, Centurion, Trebuchet's got lower armor, I believe. 
So let's go after him. Yeah, he's only got 660. Engaging. Okay, laser hit. Nice. Nice. Awaiting orders. Wilco. Bring yourself back over here. I don't want to not use the PPC because you've been doing so well. But I think we got to shut it off for a turn. And if we're going to do that, who's this guy's got a little bit of heat on him. So let's just fire the uh, LRM incendiaries on this guy. Alright, give him a bit of heat. Not a lot, but a little bit. Yeah, that Griffin still runs really hot. Like I said, man, clan weapons are great, but they're really, really hot. And until we get more um, heat sinking, it's going to be really difficult for us to do much. I can't, I can't build good what loadouts. I, I mean, we do need more gear too. All oh, the ultras jam two figures. We do need better gear too, but I mean, it's still, um, god damn, chances to hit. Alright, let's just pot shot this guy, leave the rocket pack off. Got it. Yeah, until we find better heat sinking, we not, not much Check we can do contact. about the uh, heat problems. You still got, like, this thing's got so much armor. It's crazy. Alright, let's hope we get lucky. Nope. That did not hit. It did not. Get down here, get a little bit of partial cover. I'm gonna go after the cicada, I think, this time. There we go. The only reason why, why, why I went for the Cicada and only this Cicada is it's su super lightly armored for 40 tons. And I figure if it's got two, if the pair of the LRM long fires or whatever it's got in the arms, it's got almost no armor to support that. Crap. I was going to move him out of there too, but not much we can do about it now. Standing by. Not much we can do about it now. Forty-seven. Let's go after the Centurion. Target locked. Yeah, that's suspended, but it's really lightly armored. Negative damage. Repeat. Negative, Negative damage. damage. Yeah. Still shooting that AC. Hopefully we can solve that problem this next turn. Doubt it, but... I doubt it, Standing but you by. never know. Well, our target was gone now. I was going to go after the uh, cicada with these guys, but... He's not here anymore. Dave? Dave's not here. Primitive. That's another trivia question. Where's that from? Standing by. Yo, man, it's Dave. Open the door. On my Dave? Way. Yeah, it's Dave, man. Open the door. Dave's not here, man. I know, it's Dave. Open the door. What? Open the door. It's Dave, man. Oh, there's the first miss of the PPC. Be interested to know if you guys know where that's from. Dave's not here. I know it's Dave. Open the door. <laughs> uh. Yeah. Give it to him. Ready to Let's it give on. it to him. Right now, the LRMs are about the only weapons that we can uh, use that um, in we can get some range on that aren't going to super overheat us. 
Oh, you're doing so well with that laser today. What is it? The laser and the PPC are hitting very well today. I'm enjoying that. Makes me want to put a large laser on somebody else, but then I can't sink the heat, so there's not much I can do about it. Come on, you guys. Oh, it's the low coost. He shot his load already, so there's not much he can do. Commander. Oof. Oh. Okay, well, we don't expose to those guys by going here, so let's just go up here. We've kind of got those guys pinned in back there. Let's go with the tandem, see if we can kill them in one shot here. Firing on target. Ooh, a couple good laser hits. A few tandem hits, but not much. Solid connection on that one. All right. I'm out of short range missiles. That's all right. Let's get up here. Still jammed. Well, let's just see if we can get the kill here. Put the rocket pack on, because why not? And, yep. Ah, hit the other side. Oh well. Commander. Let's use you first. Ooh, 10% this turn. Good damage. Solid connection, that one. Got a pair of large lasers Commander. coming up. Alright, let's move. Let's get on this guy, larges and the machine guns. We're gonna wind them up to the top here. Because hell they're just machine guns. Fire in our Nice, there goes his torso. That hit something good. It's gotta be tough. Using the rules of the game, I couldn't imagine ever being um, appreciative of becoming a mech pilot and then being like issued a stinger, a wasp, or a locust. Like in the confines of the game, they just don't get enough evasion or enough defense to make it worthwhile. Like, how do they survive? Now I'm taking it good. Yeah. I'm ready. Like, how do they survive? I don't even know. Yeah. Well, that's not bad. Confirmed. Let's take this one. That should be a that should be a kill. Uh, let's drop a bit of heat here. Yeah. Enemy down. Two left. Good to go. On the move, full speed. All right, let's get down here. Starting to heat up pretty bad here. Uh, let's go with the bolt on incendiaries. And let's just turn both LRMs off for this turn. Actually, you know what? Let's leave them on. Take the ER off. We'll drop all our heat this turn. Nice. Reporting critical hit. I'm out of short range missiles. Coordinates received. I know this is we're taking a chance. We gotta we gotta pray that we pull this guy down this turn, but I think we will. I'm pretty confident we'll take this guy down this turn. Unless you miss with like a lot of your lasers. Waiting on you, Commander. Gonna walk it to keep Moving our to get our stability back. Still jammed. Oh for crying out loud. All the rockets. All out of short range missiles. How am I still jail oh, finally unjammed? Yes, Commander. Okay, get in Fire. the trees. Lowers our chance to hit slightly, but still. 
Better protection. Got everything back on. Firing on this guy. Yeah, another PPC hit. Wow. See ya. Hope we can that. that guy's taking a dirt nap. His motion there, him falling face down. That's like the, uh... That's like the, the, um... The gif for the uh, explanation of dirt nap in the dictionary. You just see that guy taking a face plant. Yeah, you know who the threat is, buddy. You shoot at me this time. I got the armor to handle it. Yeah. Gonna have to get a voice for that guy. Yes, come on. I missed the AI voice. I don't know what happened to it. There used to be a voice for the AI. It's Waiting gone now. Because it makes sense, because if that's the pilot that you're supposed to be, it makes sense that there's like an AI. Because it's the AI in the cockpit talking to you. I missed. Whereas all the other voices in the game are of course the uh What's up, boss? The pilot's talking to you across the comms, right? It would just make sense. But whatever. I'm just nitpicking now. Yes! There you go. I was gonna say that's his AC arm. He killed the torso with the ammo in it. Beautiful. Mission successful. Alright, we're gonna look for straight up cash on this, I think. Unless there's any clan weapons, I'd highly doubt it. So Miss Links took a bit of damage in the arm, but that's it. Did we just Oh, it had three points left. Wow. So <laughs> you took the uh, auto cannon hit like a champ. All right, there's nothing here that we want. This would be nice, but we're not running that. We ain't running that in this playthrough. Uh, Mars, a couple of MRM10s. Um, I'm going to drop... Oop, what the hell just happened there? I'm going to drop that in. Uh, let's check for ammo, too, before I forget. So we got MRM improved, two tons. We'll grab that and the incendiary. And then, ooh, we got Thunder. We don't want Thunder for this playthrough, though. Swarm, you don't have any Artemis? Oh, he had... Oh, I see. He had extended range lasers. Or, um, uh, missiles. Where is that Cicada up here? Cicada, what did you have on you? Uh, XL engine, a pair of LRM-15s. Huh. That's 14 tons of weapon right there. You got, I mean, running at least two or three tons of ammo, too. That's like... Yeah, that's pretty heavy, uh... Pretty heavy shiz, man. Fire control system missile range. Do we have one of these? We do. Oh, I, I, he probably had that as well. Okay. All right, no heat sink. Sensor range... 10% range, minus 50% minimum range. This is good if you're running, like if you're running um, a lot of medium ranged weapons, like SRMs or medium lasers or things like that. H having that extra 10% range is uh, pretty effective. I'm actually going to, we have one of these or no? I'm going to grab that. Because we might be able to drop it in one of our lighter guys. I know one of our guys does have it. I can't remember which one does have one of those. But if we can put this in with the pulse lasers, that'll definitely help out a little bit. All right, bunch of mech parts. Flamer we don't need. Medium lasers we don't need. Small laser we don't need. We don't need these. We don't need all this. Uh, LRM dead fire ammo. I'm going to hold on to it because um, you never know. All right, so after that last successful mission, we're hooking up with the, looks like the remnants of... Um, some of the units from Karima, and we're going to hook up with them and attack a bunch of the remaining uh, Magashi Province forces in this area. We're on the edge of Karima Town here. You can see some buildings here. So we're going to move up and hopefully take these guys out. So we've got three units with us. We've got three of our own mechs and our three vehicles. So let's see how this plays out. Now we've got a Blackjack here. Pretty OG Blackjack from what I can tell. A couple of LBX-10s and a couple of Exostar lasers. Are you kidding me? What kind of jump are we looking at? Garbage jump. Garbage movement. Let's get you up here. On the move. 
got a fire bee with a shit ton of LRM pirates with Hydra ammo. Holy crap. All right, let's get you over here. I'm walking here. And then we got a heavy rifle mining drill rocket pair of rocket 15s on this Centurion. What the hell? Light machine guns with incendiary ammo. Sure, let's get you up here too. Got it. Let's take the lead out with these guys though. Let's move our guys up this way. So we got the Griffin, the Kit Fox, and the Nova on us, plus our three vehicles. So let's keep um, the Cloud Buster with these guys. And we'll keep our Hunter and our Svantavit with us. Now let's not move the Svantavit too close this time. We'll use the mortars. Alright, got enemy contact now. Whereabouts are these guys? So we've got a fire truck and a jed. They gotta have more just garbage like that. Commander. That's a nice solid line. Let's go over here and take that. Yeah, which one's scarier? I don't think it really matters. Same chance to hit on both. Tandem rockets and fluid guns. Suspicious cargo. Yeah, I think we go after this guy first. <laughs> Anytime you see suspicious, you know it's time to kill the thing. Acknowledge. Oh yeah, laser hit. Nice. Nice. Aye, aye. Yeah, let's give it a bit of a sprint. See if we can get that PPC on there. Here we go. You ran four for five last time. Let's see if you can go same this time. Shoot this suspicious cargo. Nope. LRM's hit really nicely though. That's beautiful. Who's next? Gatekeeper. Same idea. Let's uh, kill that, kill that uh, suspicious cargo with excessive fire. Maybe not with Sam ammo though. Yeah, we really need to get uh, Artemis in this thing. See ya. Well, Waiting for there's orders. not going to be anything left for these guys to do once we get through with these uh, these guys over here. Why do I have a feeling we're going to get jumped by more? Let's go this way. Confirmed. Keep our eyes open on that side. Good to go. I got a feeling we're going to get jumped. I mean, it is rogue tech, so it wouldn't be surprising. Alright. First time I've seen this map, though. It's kind of cool. Well, we can't get any solid line, but we can get a partial line here. Take the partial. Hammer him. Now before I let any of these idiots shoot, I'm gonna make sure they're we're not in front of them in any way. Another vehicle. So this is this is a two and a half skull mission as well. You only have Hydra. Just running. That's all you got. You would be scary if you could actually get close. Look at these po look, the suits these guys are wearing, man. It's crazy. Uh huh. Light damage, Commander. Need something, Chief? Got it. Get down here. It's got to be more than just these guys. This can't be it. Urban tank, LRM. Good to go. So that thing's got an LR, a pair of LRM 15s and, an, and a pair of SRM 4s. Moving out. Not that scary. The armor's actually not that bad on it, though. Let's target this guy first, though. Roger that. Yeah, no laser hit. Roger Gonna that. keep moving this way around the edge of the city. 
or the town or whatever it is. Fire on this guy. Pretty good chance to hit. PPC hit. Nice. 50-50 so far in this match. Being a good leader, I'll lead from in front. And we'll fire on this guy. See ya. That can't, this can't be all they have at this skull rating. Stand and buy. Quick step in it. All right, nothing up here. Commander. Unless it was, unless it just screwed up somehow and it was just supposed to be one mech that was supposed to go in with these guys. And the I'm fact that I've got wait. vehicle lance and a second lance screwed up the uh, calculation on the uh, enemies. That's a possibility. Standing by. I'd right, stubble. Oh. Orders. You can't move. Burger time. You can't move either. Just go around this way. Full speed. No target. I know. I'm your spaniel. I know technically this mission is we're supposed to be getting these guys some experience, but let's just reserve you. But as this guy's name implies, they are pretty crappy. Who the hell names their 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 guy Guano? Let's just go cluster. Firing. I have no idea where those ended up. No joy. You're killing the civilians. If they're not dead already, look at this town. Uh huh. He's got a large laser, huh? Someone's got a large laser. Bulldog. ER large. Okay. Yes, Commander. Just sit there and mortar this guy. On it. You're not gonna do a lot of damage anyway, so you might as well just pot shot it. At least they're targeting these idiots. Uh-huh. It's not gonna help you. Waiting for orders. Not gonna help you. How do you can you not get oh because you can't Oh, right. There's no access. Fire bees missing jump jets. Standing by. That's the kind of mech you'd want to have jump jets on. You jump in, burn the shit out of everything, and then jump away. Alright, uh... 20% on you... Yeah. Fire. Ooh, we got some of the guys over here. Didn't see those guys. It's a good thing you took a shot at them. Alright, take another shot over here. 18%. Commander. Pole cat. We'll go. They better have more guys than this, just this. Target lost. Yes, Commander. Affirmative. At least we're getting some good work out of the uh, hunter this time. All right, shitbird, get up here. I guess I should have checked your armor before I sent you in that close. 780. All right, that's not bad. Ready for order. Easy to survive against those guys, anyway. Can we get down this way? We can, I think. I think we can. This fire bee would be the perfect mech to use against these vehicles I'm if it here. could actually get within fucking range. I mean, I guess that is my fault, but whatever. These guys are guarding our rear. Let's look at this thing. It's just crazy, the internal combustion engine. Could you imagine being in a mech with the internal combustion engine, what that would sound like? That would just be crazy. Systems holding. Standing like, by. you think standing next to a tank when it starts up is bad. Can you imagine standing next to one of those guys when it started up? 
the size of the engine that you have to, to, to have to... Ooh, damn it. You hit. To, for a mech like this. To run like a 50 ton mech, are you kidding me? Receiving you. Alright. Just keep going this way, we'll flank him a bit. Still on this guy. Target confirmed. Awaiting orders. Same guy. Getting a little closer with the PPC, but not Firing much. On target. All right. Still hoping for that that PPC Longer. kill shot, but I don't think we'll get another one of those. Go. She did well in that first match, and that's all that matters. All right, this guy's getting softened up. Something awful. Commander, you're still not in the range here. Get up on the rack. Get on the rack over here. Hammer this guy. I really hope it's more than these guys, because this is like... I'm receiving you. Super bad. Copy that, Commander. I took this Cloud Buster because it had the... Uh, two large lasers, and I Let thought we had some good range with those, but I guess not. 540 meters, I think. I should. I, I was thinking around 800, but that's not. The PPC is like 820, I think, or, or 8, 840 or 860. I think the larges are around 540 or 600 or something. Oh, you moved to the fire. Took a little damage. You keep staying indirect. You keep staying that indirect. Ready for orders. I wonder if there's guys in these buildings. Ready for orders. Just thinking about that now. Like, we're up a hill right here, so we have to go around, but I wonder if there's guys in the buildings. And these guys are supposed to, like, we're supposed to go in there to get these guys. Here you go. Oh, I got a few hits on them. Not bad. Standing by. Let's start moving back this way. Can we get down that way? We could have got down that way. Oh well, no big deal. No big deal. Come on. I know I could use tab, but I'm just lazy. It's been a long day at work. Long day at work. I don't want to think too hard. So many friggin' jobs today. Working on four different jobs today. And of course, if it wasn't like do one, finish Ready it, work on the next one, it's like do one, make no some problem. changes, on send it to way. the client, or send it off to the creative team. Do another Tell change on a different job, send it out to the creative team. Then I got changes for the first job again. I go back to the changes for that. It's like bouncing back and forth all day long, and I just get you just get flustered. You know, you can't you can't perform your best when that's happening. You try to stay focused, but you just Locking on. It just doesn't happen, you know. At least not to the, the degree what that the you want it to. Oh Almost. god. Yes, Commander. Double. Still can't. Let's go this way. I think he can probably get down over there. Ready for orders. Booger time. Booger booger. Acknowledged. I got a feeling it's just this last vehicle. That's it. It's gonna be garbage salvage. Damage is light. Garbage salvage. Yes, Commander. Start heading down the hill. Now let's bring you up. 
give this fire bee that little bit of extra cover. Oh, that's not bad. Oh, we got one hit. Give that fire bee a little extra protection in case somebody else shows up. For my opening. Ah, shit. That guy's not gonna move, eh? I'm receiving you. Finally, got some indirect. Acknowledged. Let's burn your city down. Target confirmed. Yeah, maybe not. It wasn't me shooting, so I don't feel bad. Alright, target this guy from where we are. Yes, Commander. Alright. That'll give us a direct line of sight on this guy. Okay. What's up, boss? For good time. Roger. Full speed. Yes, Commander. Sure. Firing on target. Wow, three points, huh? Awaiting orders. Hauling ass. These drops the at least that drops the heat. I think they've got the heat management in this game. What was that? Uh what was that? Commander? I feel they've got the heat management in this Control. game pretty good now. It's not overbalanced when you get overheated, like you can't you're not basically stopped okay. anymore. You're taking heat damage. No love on the that fact that strike. if you know if you overheat, Commander. your ammo could cook off a lot easier. Things like that. I think they've got that kind of managed pretty well here. Look how fast this thing is. All right, that's pretty good. Let's crank these up. Look at this obscene thing. Receiving you. All right, Guano. Let's get up here, but not block anybody, so the rest of us can get up and do something. Confirmed. Thank you. All right, who's next? What's up, boss? Hi, right, Blade. I'm already there. Okay, let's fire at this guy. Yes, a large hit again. This guy's going down. I'm out of SRM. Going down this turn. Still indirect, huh? Can I get a direct line of sight if I No, I can't. No point in moving then. Alright, soften him up a little more. Yes, Commander. There we go. Looking On for that move. nice solid red line. Alright, not bad. Taking the top. Ah shit. Sorry about that. No long range missiles remaining. Apologize for that. Orders. Didn't mean to destroy your buildings. On the move. Hammer him. It's almost done. Oh, he's done. That's it? Ah, oh, for crap. That, that was just really... Well... Mission successful. We're such badasses. What, you launched a couple of Inferno rounds and that's it. I saw it continue and I thought maybe there was another second part to it, but I guess not. Oh well. It is what it is. Yeah. Oh, I keep forgetting the Jet is a J. Edgar. Take that. Uh, ooh, a pair of more MRM-10s, though. Suspicious cargo. Suicide bomb. Damage 50. AOE. Within 100 meters. Okay. That could be bad. Tandem rockets, 240 core, maybe, how much is this worth? 550. 
I guess there's no double heat sinks in here or anything. This is worth a hundred thousand once we sell it. Uh LRM double O M regular MRM ammo. We've got one. Uh We've got clan ER late. We got I think we've got two clan ER larges, so let's just drop that out of the and we'll take the MRM ammo. Just so we have it. If we lose it in the future okay, if we lose ammo in the future, at least we'll have some backup. Alright. Bunch of vehicle parts. Streak two, which we can just sell. Suspicious cargo we have no use for, so we can sell that. The wrecking ball. Four ton melee, eh? You know, here's the thing. I think I might want to get that Griffin into it as a melee mech. Because it's got... Its quirks are like bonus for punching and things like that, right? So that Griffin might actually end up being a melee mech. And does 60 damage, this thing. 60 stability damage. Oh, man. So we're going to hang on to that. You can go. Uh, you can go. You can go. You can go. Goodbye. 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 LRM double... Let's just hang on to it for now. All right, so that is the battle for Karima City, and we have successfully defeated Magashi Province in this area. So we're going to be moving down to take out the clans below us, I think, next. Uh, the l drastic losses of the Magashi mechs in this area is severely undermined their ability to have any kind of military prowess in this area now. So we're going to uh, work on getting... Uh, Karima's border is a little wider than they were uh, just so they get a buffer zone if anything happens we've already, we've already pledged to protect them so uh, what we'll do is we'll probably end up giving them any scrap that we picked up off of uh, the past few missions anything that we're not using vehicle parts whatever so they can put together some defense forces for the area uh, but we're going to go ahead and take care of the clans to the south I think next that's really the big threat and then we'll figure out where we're going from there but I'm going to leave this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.